Hi everyone and welcome, my name is David Mortimer from the technical team at DMS. Today's video is an overview of the Honeywell range of gas regulators and slam shut valves that we are the distributor for for the UK. Should you have any questions at all, please feel free to get in touch with our sales team in the office or leave us a comment in the box below. The first regulator we'll be looking at is the J48 Low Pressure Governor. This is available from sizes of 3 quarter inch up to 3 inch with a threaded female connection and then from 65mm up to 150mm they can be supplied with a PN16 flanged connection as well. The maximum inlet pressure that these regulators can withstand is 350 millibar, and the standard range that we hold in stock on all of the sizes are with a spring with an outlet range of 12 to 25 millibar. but the springs can be freely swapped for other required outlet pressures uh, and we do stock them as spares as well. So get in touch with us and we'll certainly help size up this particular item for your application. A smaller cousin of the J48 is the J78 range. Uh, these are available from sizes of half inch up to one inch and have uh, a smaller tolerance of outlet pressures from the regulators, but there are still variable ranges that we can offer. There are two models of the J78. There's the J78R and the RS. Uh, one of them as an option has a blank connection on the vent port and the other version, the J78RS, has actually a screwed connection instead. The vent itself is purely there for the displacement of air in case of the diaphragm moving. The J48 has exactly the same item fitted on itself but there is only one type of connection on the port. Uh, again, we stock this particular one with outlet pressures rated for around 21 millibar, that is the standard. The J78RS is rated for inlet pressures up to 350 millibar, and the J78R is rated for pressures up to 100 millibar. Next on the list is the J125 regulator. Uh, this is a bit more of an industrial design. It's available in sizes of 3 quarter inch, 1 inch, inch and a half and two inch, or with a female BSP threaded connection. Uh, but you can also get a flanged PN16 version of the 50mm uh, version of this as well. There are a whole host of different models that are to suit different combinations, as these are not just regulators, but they can also have the built-in uh, OPSO or OPSO assembly. So that's an overpressure shutoff or an underpressure shutoff. These can withstand much higher inlet pressures of up to 8.6 bar and much higher outlet pressures as well. Again, standard stock is generally centered around the 21 millibar outlet pressure, but again, we can offer full capability of swapping out springs for different outlet pressures, different orifices for higher flow rates or lower flow rates. And uh, these actually can also have a capacity relief valve built into them, which is this vent here. Uh, what that will do is when outlet pressures get a little bit too high, uh, rather than the OPSO assembly from stepping in and shutting off the system, that can vent a small amount of gas to atmosphere just to alleviate some pressure and keep everything nice and safe and under control. The final item we're looking at today is the S100 slam shut valve. Uh, these are available in sizes of 50mm, 80mm and 100mm, all with a PN16 flanged connection. This valve is designed for OPSO uh, use so it will shut off when pressures reach too high a point. Um, they generally work via an external impulse. The line will go further down past the regulators. And should everything fail, then certainly the OPSO on the S100 will step in, shut off the gas supply, uh, and to protect any downstream equipment from dangerous pressures. Then it can all be reset simply on the top here so that the valve can reopen again. It will equalize pressure itself as well. And from that point on, the system is back open again and will continue running. That's all I've got for you for today. Thank you very much for watching and please stay subscribed to the channel and we shall see you in the next video.